Welcome back to Headbanger Gamer. I'm the Headbanger Gamer. <laughs> You're full of malarkey. <laughs> Welcome back to Headbanger Gamer, where we just finished Poochie's <laughs> Tight Trail. Okay, I just went in like two different accents. All right. So, so far, so good. We're progressing relatively well. I lost my water wheel. We're alarmed, is what we are. I am a little bit above startled right now, but I think I'll be okay. <laughs> I mean, not as scared as those Yoshi were when they saw those puppies. Oh, let's go find them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, it, it's a race to find them, guys. We got to hurry up. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Run! Stop! I, what is happening right now? <laughs> I'm so confused. Wow, look at this. This is really creative, actually. We're, There's cornflakes down there. Sorry, we have a limited amount of time to find these dogs before they hurt themselves. Or we hurt ourselves. I'm not sure. We've, we've ingested heavy amounts of stimulants before we began this level. I don't know. What's up with that? It's been 32, 3, 4 seconds. We still have Wait, I just, I just noticed this was timed. Yes, Shoot. this one is timed. Well, and you're, yet you're going to waste all your time getting these things? We are going to need them. You know it. I don't know, man. Do go, 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 go. Oh Damn, my gosh, what we are, is going on? We are having a bad time. No, we're having a good time. No. No, I don't know. I don't know. Jeremy, about that. just get ready to aim, okay? <laughs> Shoot yeah. that stuff. Oh jeez, I am doing terrible at this. Look, you have one job, buddy, and that is to shoot stuff that is in our way. Look, man, I've I've ingested a lot of stimulants. I'm freaking out right now. I need you to calm down. I, no! I need you to take a deep breath no. for five. No. Thank you. They're coming after me. No, nobody's coming after us. We are coming after the puppies. <laughs> We're looking for the puppies. Oh, so the puppies should be paranoid. Wait Understood. Wait a second. Okay, we just can't go that way. Fine. That There's nothing over there. Oh. Come on. The puppies should not be paranoid. They should be scared because they've lost us. Why should they be scared? Jeremy, I would just like you to know that you are playing this game as well as I am, and you need to shoot stuff! Well, you know what? This Look at this beautiful view. How could you want to shoot anything? Because it will kill you. Please shoot that. Okay. I'm just so in love with this game world. You're so in love, you're surrounded by hearts. Oh, oh no, it. no. Don't take the bait. I'm not... I'm Why'd sorry. you shoot that? Look, I. You know what? Literally, the one time you didn't need to shoot something, and, and you yet, shoot it. and yet, you chose to drop off the tower. Because um, I couldn't go anywhere. Okay, hold it, hold it, go. Okay, what the heck? Go where? Right here. <laughs> what? 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 I had a little rager. Sorry. <laughs> Why you do it? Why you do it? All right. So we're supposed to be finding puppies. I'm not finding any puppies. You're not shooting anything either. <laughs> well, I am just a pacifist. All of a sudden, <laughs> I learned heavy amounts of. Stimulates make me a pacifist. You know, maybe they make you aggressive, but you know what? They make me love everything. They uh, make me want peace. In fact, I feel like if I were ever to give a, a speech on world peace, it would be under the influence of stimulants. This Heavy explains, amounts of stimulants. This explains all the 60s. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. No, it does not. No, they were all under stimulants and f decided to be pacifists. Okay, first of all, we, they were under a whole lot of things at the same exact time. They were on stimulants. They were on depressants. They were on hallucinogens. Sometimes all at the same time. I don't believe it's as cut and dry as you think it is. 
I, I, I'm pretty sure that you just explained the six, six. So like, I'm giving like a peace speech, right? And I'm just like, oh yeah, world peace. And like, my eye is like twitching the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, ah, oh, I just love this world. It's so peaceable. We just want world. What was that? What was that? <laughs> It's like if somebody was work looking at you, they would be like, uh, guys, Jeremy's glitching again. I'm like, world peace. World peace. There's a glitch in the Jeremy uh, software. Jeremy yeah. software does not compute. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's that's what I was thinking. Smash and crush with go-go Yoshi. Uh, use a punch up or down or hold and... Okay, you hold I'm sorry. the down I'll, button I'll, down. Let me try this again. Smash and crush, crush with a go-go Yoshi. Go, 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 go Yoshi. Use... <sighs> use your Joy-Con to do up or... Are you tickling it? <laughs> oh my Ew. god. He's like, ooh. <laughs> We want to get as many flowers. What? Oh, got it. Got it. Uh -huh. Check me out. Are you using the other one? Are you... Am I like the only one? I'm operating one arm. I don't... Oh, it's the down. Oh. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Check it out. Check okay. me out. Okay. You know what's funny? I think that if you want, if you want to know what the solution to world peace is... You need to have each country build a giant robot, and then we need to pit our robot against the foreign adversary, and then we have a competition, and then the winner robot from the winner country gets to decide the terms. And then, you know, people wouldn't die, and our world peace would be somewhat achieved by taking the pro- This is where you stop me, because I feel like I'm already going too far here. I'm picturing the olympics but for robots and that's how we decide who's the greatest of us all <laughs> i wish it could be like that but then like people will be like sore losers right i'm not gonna bring up any specific countries because i love everyone from every country but think about it like if say like a country you beat a country fair and square right and then they go hey that wasn't fair you you juiced your robot if it makes any sense and then you just say yeah i juiced him with oil you, you mook and then they say no you juiced him with something that you shouldn't juice him with then they're just going to resort to old-fashioned warfare because they just they couldn't take being defeated. I don't think there could possibly be an illegal thing to juice your robot with. Okay, but we don't know that. I mean, I mean, there's I mean, if you have the better robot and the better robot juice, you have the better robot juice. Okay, I, I'm really uncomfortable by how like peaceable and understanding you are. I. I was really hoping you would just rip me apart on why we would be juicing robots in the first place. No, I'm sorry. We... This is the type of thing that I think about normally on a regular basis. <laughs> so it has not even begun to occur to me that this might be a weird topic of conversation. <laughs> yeah. I'm just letting... Uh, I'm just kind of letting it fly at this point. I mean, we're already uh, pretty deep into these recording sessions, and now we're getting into the esoteric realms of conversation oh would you like to teach those of them at home that don't know what esoteric means and also i don't know what it means oh well, that makes sense <laughs> esoteric is kind of like uh the the dark secret arts of something so like uh you know people that like are into like religious systems for example like there there might be like a secret a super secret sect of like that religion and then that sect of the religion is like dedicated to finding like all the deep secrets of that religion mm. and that's considered like esoteric like i'm into the esoteric things of of whatever religion i'm into the deep dark secrets of that the religion. esoteric things of robots look at that evangelion that's shaped like a yoshi <laughs> <laughs> you just changed the topic. It's like, I have no answer. Um, I'm wiped out. If only I had... <coughs> ten, ten smiley flowers? These blocks are getting fatter and fatter. Oh. No, give it... What? Hold on. I... Okay, I see I see where you're going. You're, you want to see what his reaction is if you don't give it to him. No, I mean, like, I just feel like I'm his parent, and he's just, like, emptying me out. <laughs> Well, why doesn't he get a job? I think it's just trying to teach 
us to be generous. It's not really teaching us that people just suck us dry of smiley flowers. It's just trying to teach us to give. It's like, you know, a really good thing to know how to do. Share instead of, you know, hogging to yourself. You know. Well, next time I hit Bigger Gamer, <laughs> we are going to go to Minecart Cave. Thank you so much for joining us. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and ring a ring a ding ding ding. Ring a ding ding ding. That bell, and please check out our Patreon because we have exclusive content on there, and your giving keeps the lights on, to which we need to record these things. So, without further ado, adieu, right? We will let you all go. See you next time.